please, can I play a video game where I'm a gender fluid, ethnically ambiguous Latina creature thing, lady something? Said no one fucking ever. Folks, welcome to the channel and good news, Star Wars Outlaws is just around the corner and I cannot wait to never play it in my fucking life. But anyway, here we go with the official story trailer. Uh, and you know it's good when it's written by Nikki Foy, who, yeah, you go, girl. Yes, you you show though that male patriarchy how you can fuck up Star Wars and make something thing that no one ever will want to play, just like they've been doing all along with all of these wonderful series of Star Wars that so many people love and definitely do watch all the time. This is sure gonna be so much better. Yeah, yeah, especially with Ubisoft behind it. Each of you represents some of the most powerful criminal organizations oh, in the galaxy. Yeah. Pikes, Crimson, Lady, Alien, Huts, Alien Lady, to Golden A. Bad white guy, because yes, of course. Each for the underworld. The Empire controls every corner of the galaxy, but they're distracted by a rebellion that won't quit. It's an opportunity to make millions. Kay Vess, the underworld's favorite new scoundrel. Fuck. We meet at last. What do you want? Zarek Besh. They're new, rich, and lethal. You crossed their boss, Slero, and now he wants you gone. Rob his fortune, buy your freedom. This job, it's a death wish. I'm in. Out here, you live and die by your reputation. You want to survive? Know the players. Hey, you're new to this world. What's your problem? Come back when you're not. Daba, right? Look, don't try anything. I got a whole crew surrounding the... Okay, we're skipping that part. For about as long as I can remember, it's just been me and Nyx. Doing what we have to, to survive. This job is my one shot at freedom. But if we're gonna pull this off, we need the right crew. And the right ship. in the outer rim she's more connected than you look <laughs> these people fuck <laughs> so nikki foy is not just okay i mean you you're forced to play I mean, it's nice when you have a choice this is supposed to be a role-playing game right in role-playing games it's nice when you have uh, have some actual choices like can i not be the latina lady thing there that you have going on um but they are so narrow-sighted. They're so obsessed with their fucking agenda. Uh, with, with this, with this shit that they do all the time. This is how they ruin Star Wars. This is how they ruin uh, what could have been a, a, a cool video game. Who would not love to play a, a true open-world RPG Star Wars game? Yes, but when you do this shit, when, when you force your agenda down people's throat, it is so... Forceful is so unnatural. So you have this scoundrel badass who happens to just be a lady, okay? Uh, and then the the meanest bounty hunter in the world, in the galaxy, you know, in the universe, is this uh, also uh, gender inclusive, fluid, short haired black lady. You know, is it too much to ask to have one actual dude in this? scoundrel crazy pirate badass criminal underworld no we cannot ask for that no it has to be all but on Slero, this yeah. is mixed up in something bigger no one wants to play this let's let's get real no one wants to be the latina lady uh, with, with a cat and i'm from south america myself this is not how anyone in south america looks this is how the racists of this woke 
cult believe that inclusive South American people should look. Psychopaths like Nikki Foy think that this is how some weird uh, version of what inclusion is. You know, like a fucking what what my five year old ends up when they mix up a bunch of paints and they end up with some fucked up thing. That's how. Yeah, that in many ways that's how racist they are. They don't don't think about uh, other cultures for real. It's just the way they wish the world would perceive inclusion. They're not really about including anything. No, all they want is to force their message down your throat. And that's why they fail, because people don't like that. And I can assure you, video game players, guys that play video yes, guys, it's mostly guys that play video games. It's rather small, the amount of women playing action video games. You don't identify with this. You don't see yourself reflected in that. This is not what you strive to be. You don't strive to be a, 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 this ethnically ambiguous lady that doesn't look like anything and wants to be everything at all at the same time. But certainly you cannot be a white guy. That is, you know, you know doesn't matter. You will not convince a, a man to play this. A, any normal person. What would a guy? A, a guy wants to be uh, a, a, the, the Witcher with that badass wolf as your as your sidekick pet, not a, a little weird cat thing. This is what Nikki Foy wants. And you know how many Nikki Foys are out there willing to buy video games? Very fucking little, not nearly enough. That's why they fail with their movies. That's why they keep on losing millions and millions with their TV series. That's why this will fail as well. And I'm not even getting into the actual video game, which is not looking all that great. But the outer this. rim is a dangerous place. Yeah, and it looks pretty damn small and very little true RPG by the way. Everyone is fighting for their piece of the galaxy. I want is to live free. So I'm gonna risk it all. It's all cutscenes. They're, they're not showing you the game. And if you're trying to sell, you know, <laughs> if you go back to how they were presenting uh, Starfield, they were showing you the game. You could criticize it or you can have any opinion you want, but they were showing you what you were playing eventually. What you would eventually play and for all of the good and bad and it's at least for me it's mostly a lot of good you knew what you were being dealt with this a, a pre-order on what on, on cutscenes are they mental with their history with ubisoft being the company that it is that they keep on failing and failing and <laughs> keep on <laughs> i mean they there's no trust in this company anymore and there's no trust in, in the people behind star wars anymore they're morally bankrupt. They've done so much of this shit that no one trusts them anymore. Hold on, Nick. Pre-order. Yeah, you know what? No. Uh, no. No, no pre-ordering. No money for any of this. Let's actually wait to see the reviews and not the paid for reviews. Give it a few months. Give it five, six months, and and then maybe, and then maybe if you're if you're sure that you want to be crazy cat lady there, ugly cat, because it's not even that you have a hot girl there. Like, uh, oh yeah, uh, what is it? The video game that they were just trying to bring down, and they're just killing it in sales. That they have this Asian anime over the top. But yeah, that that's what's fun. No one wants your politics in our fun. It's not entertaining. It's politics. And if you want to engage in politics, you go do that. For people that want to enjoy a video game, this is not it. This, this is not what you want to do. This is not what you want to do with your free time. So, in terms of the video game, we don't know a damn thing. We, all we know is that there's going to be very little role-playing going on. I mean, exactly what? What do I have? Like base building? Can I build my own ship? Of course not. I won't be building my own ship in this shit show. That's obvious enough. Um, ship combat? I mean, I was doing the video on, on, on jump ship. That looks very promising. They show you what there's 
uh, involved in the video game, what you're likely to end up doing. This is just what cut scene after the other. It's gonna be the same damn shit all over again with this pile of crap as you leave. Look at that face. Who wants to see that? Honestly, these people are not well. They need professional help. But you know what? Before they get it, they're gonna be losing a shitload of money until, you know, until they, they have nothing else to burn. Until they burn the last credibility, the get last goodwill that fans of Star Wars have. Until that point, they will not stop. Until it's completely destroyed. Guys, cannot wait to not play this. See you next time.